They back off of him. Deco. This is better football from Portugal. Now they're starting to find the little spots into the midfield, playing from side to side like an accordion. Then they're looking for their playmaker, Deco. Just evades three players, gets into the spot. But I like the change of play. And that's it for Deco. He will be the. That's it for Cristiano Ronaldo. Yeah, they boot him all the time, but now they hate to see him go. He really turned this match alight. Just played two days ago. In comes Simao. Good performance from Cristiano Ronaldo. I, I like the way that he was, not just what he was doing on the ball, but. There you go. Kaka. Still just the two yellow cards from the first half on the board for Martin Atkinson. Great game. Uh, the lack of scoring. Here's a nil-nil game that you can proudly present to them. There's a case where you may not need to score. See him out. Goal! You don't have to pass the case on now because we have a goal. The volley attempt from Simao. 82nd minute. Impeccable timing right here from Simao Sarosa. And see again, the pressure on the goalkeeper. We talked about it earlier in the first half. Great. Great ball. This is on. No, just offside from Adriano. It had to be oh so close. Nice little in the reaction that they were lacking in the World Cup, but playing out of the back. Really is. Quaresma put the final touches on his man of the match performance. Hugo Viana, glancing ball. Goal! Ricardo Cavallo with an ankle tap in the 90th. And this is just great football intelligence. Look at this, Brazil, two players with their back. This is something where you get these players, even in a losing effort for Brazil, some first-rate experience in a top-notch venue with a uh, very uh, difficult. He's a player that opens up. He's like a Ferrari. That's the it. Luis Felipe Scolari against his homeland. Win it again.